What's up guys and in today's tutorial I'll be showing you how to use and install Block Protection Reloaded. And what this plugin is is just like a grief protection plugin and it's really good because it protects every single block that a player on your server places down and no one else can break that block or any other block that they place down unless they add someone to their friends list anyone on the friends list can destroy the block that the other players place down on your server so it will just protect every block and it's really good um, so yeah you'll need vault I have a link in the description for vault so download that if you don't have it already and put that in your plugins folder so if you already have vault go ahead and download block protection reloaded alright here's the download now put this in your plugins folder and restart your server alright so now that our server is restarted go into your plugins folder double click on the block protection folder and click on the config file so if you want um, I would leave this as true unless you want every player to type slash BP as soon as they join your server but if it's left as true then they don't have to type that and block protection is already on and enable bypass by default that's just if if it's false then they have to type this command right here slash BP admin if it's true they can automatically bypass any players blocks disable broadcast allow placing next to blocks um I'll leave this as false because other players can just place their blocks and cover up what other people have created so I'll leave this as false if you don't want that to happen um you can ignore this unless you have unless you have used the plugin watch block disable worlds where you don't want world or block protection at so if you don't want to block protection on any worlds then go ahead and list it down remember to use backspace and spaces instead of tabs and then you type in your world here but I want it on every world so I'm not going to type anything blacklist that is any items that will not be protected um that's basically it so save this up and restart your server I'll show you what it looks like on Minecraft okay so don't forget to give your players and groups these permissions here now that we are on Minecraft I'll be showing you how this works how the block protection works so I'm gonna build a wool house real quick and I'm gonna get on a cracked version to show you how a player cannot destroy what I build and to show that every block will be protected and also to be showing you something with world edit that's important so I guess I'll call this my house right quick my house right here yeah 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 th th this is my house right here alright so now I'll put a sign and a door just to give it some extra s okay hold on there we go alright now I'm gonna get on a normal players account and show you that these blocks cannot be destroyed with this plugin so yeah as you can see I am a regular player I've got a starter kit I've got a welcome message and it says default in the lower left corner so I'm showing you that I cannot destroy these blocks 
block owned by numero uno baby that's my other account see that players cannot show other people's blocks this is a great grief protection plugin now I'm gonna go back and show you something else real quick before I end the video okay so there's one thing that is might be a little struggle for you guys let's say you build something with world edit like I don't know hold on. um this dirt floor so let's say this is built with world edit or you build something huge with world edit and you didn't place all those blocks single handedly so because you didn't place them single handedly the block protection won't count it but they they made it so where you can use a command to transfer all the blocks you created with world edit after you select the region so I'm gonna select this region here and I'm gonna transfer it so that all these blocks that I've selected the region for can be protected with the block protection so type in BP transfer and then your name and these blocks are all transferred and this is very handy if you're using world edit and building something huge like a castle all you have to do is select the region and type in that command and all those blocks will be transferred so that's basically it for this tutorial thanks for watching guys and subscribe